Hey, this is Kevin here at Supportcast. Well, following on from our quick tip of yesterday of uh, embedding Picasa slideshow into Rapid Weaver, I thought we'd move this on a little bit and just show you how to uh, tart this up a little bit, add some spice. So here's our basic slideshow, which uh, works okay. That's all nice. So the first thing is we'll take the thumbnail image. Now if I just jump to Safari, and what I've done here is I've just copied the image address and created just an HTML tag, image source, what that address was, and just closed it. Now, what we can do is you can add a link and we could take it to a slideshow page. And so, here we go. And we just go to the new page with slideshow. That's one way of doing it. Another way is using stacks and a, just one other plugin and some HTML knowledge. You can actually have this pop open now, of course, I'm going to show the Flowbox stack because I'm a little bit biased here, but this method will work for whatever light box you're going to use with some adjustments. So here's our image again. This is an HTML stack I've dropped in here. I've just uh, added some divs here. But what is quite important is the embed code for the slideshow we're going to use on this stacks page. I've given it an ID of inline one and it's wrapped in a hidden div, so hide it now, display none. And here the link is going to hash inline one. So go to this anchor reference or div that's called inline one. And last of all, we use Flowbox. So I'll just uh, darken up our opacity here. And what does this do? Well, you now have a light box for your slideshow on the same page. Pretty cool. Hope you enjoy that. And that's the end of this quick tip.